Good morning. Good morning. This is weekend three of it, I believe. Well, episode four. Episode four. Oh yeah, because the last one was split into two parts. Cool. Well, um, today's quite a simple day, I think. I think it's just like finishing touches, making things look a little bit nicer, and an extra light. Which is going? Above our kitchen unit. And my favourite thing is one of our curtain sets are going up. Oh, our curtains. That's because not. good old Nan, thanks Nan, uh, has done one of the sets. We're going to have to do a click and collect service when I when she's finished the other ones for uh because obviously we're in lockdown. Yeah, which gives us more time in here though, so it's not the end of the world. But yeah, I think this weekend is just going to be neatening up neatening some wiring. Up all of that. All that wiring up there. Carpeting, all this red stuff out. Yeah. Just the finishing touches. Might have a cup of tea in here later as well. I want to have our lunch in here. What have we got for lunch? Dunno. Go get something. Mm, maybe. We'll see. Okay. Go. Cool. That is it. Yep, yeah, we put our clips in, didn't we, the other day? Oh, yeah. That's my lunch fork. But yeah, just going to cl clip them back together. All the wiring's tucked in there. The gas is cold enough. We drew that to work the other day and we had no spillages, which is good. Put the wiring up here for that, tucked out the way. You can't really see. Next thing we need to buy is the fridge. Yeah. We need to have a little like, gap in here, don't we? Fit in there. We also want some kind of storage seat to go there where Harry's sitting, like an ottoman um, that we can either already has like a cushion on top or we can put a cushion on top. Seen loads of like square ones that people are using as their loo, which is a great idea, but we don't want one for a loo. We want it like a long one for storage and for sitting on. So when we're having lunch and dinner and stuff, we can sit opposite as well as next to each other and we can put shoes and like uh, bedding, or... bedding in it and stuff like that. So any um, suggestions of where we could get a decent one, wooden preferably, um, and like obviously not too big. Let yeah, because we need to be able to, well, if we get a fridge that opens that way, it'll be fine. If we get a fridge that opens that way, with the bends out, it'll be a struggle, so. And most fridges do open that way. Oh no, they don't. I'm pretty sure you can decide what hand your fridge is. We're not building it. No, but when you buy them, I'm sure there's like, there's not a one way open fridge. I guess so. Although all the fridges I've opened, I open that way. Your fridge, my fridge at my house. I'm sure there must be fridges that I can't be around. <laughs> so I had to pop round to um, my nan, socially distanced, so I didn't go inside obviously to um, drop an anniversary present. And while I've been gone, Harry has got the third lighting. I'm not gonna attempt to turn them on just in case it's not all properly wired yet. Um, I don't know, he's actually doing something. I don't know what he's doing. Um, so I am now gonna check if our lovely curtains fit nicely at the back. Bits and sides that need to be covered as well. So, 
that is my task right now while Harry's doing whatever he's doing because I don't know what he's doing. So it turns out that this isn't long enough to do the back so I think I'm going to do inside on the side door instead because I think that's more important at the moment because that's what we're going to see more whereas the back um, Harry might have something in mind that might be a little bit better to cover that up so priorities. <music> brightens it right up doesn't it i put the lid on the junction box and not that one actually sink darling i'm gonna do what old uh, max does i'm gonna go buy some craft beers for tomorrow craft beers he, he drinks really nice like uh aussie beers and that made me really jealous of all the aussie beers wonderful so got the other light in today faithful granddad with his whole saws yeah put it in line with this one which is predominantly going to be used for the uh, kitchen area do you want that off on its own? So you just have a kitchen light or? Nah. Nah. I think when you put this one on, that's like for night times, isn't it? And stuff like yeah. that. But like when we're during the day and stuff, it makes a hell of a difference, especially with the floor lights coming yeah, up. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it looks really good. So we've neatened up all the wiring back here. I've got the JB lid on. The only thing we've got left to do is this wiring up here, which I'm thinking we're gonna do some kind of spiral wrap where we're going to cover it in like black wrap so it looks a little bit neater and then we'll clip it along here and then drop down the back here so that won't look too bad because we can't run it behind the wood because where we bolt down here is a uh, flush up against the well this wood connects to the uh, wood we've connected to the van so we can't run any cables behind it so what we're going to have to do is uh clip it in black spiral wrap along here and drop it down but hopefully when we get the cutlery rack and stuff like that mm -hmm. we should be able to hide it all what do you think should be here soon i'm very happy wonderful if you're happy i'm happy yeah. even though you have knocked all my jaw bits over no they were like that lies <laughs> they were ruby hey little princess come on then hello What I would do is, you know them bits of wood that are out there? Do you think, hang on, I've just had a quick idea. Do you think it's a good idea to put the carpet on there and then like, work, like cut it round so it goes on one why don't you make? Why don't you then measure from there to there, length to length. So if you cut, cut a bit of carpet, that is, but then you're gonna waste so much in the middle. I would just do four strips. I would do, mm -hmm. yeah, I would go 
from the top of that right to the bottom you got to inflict the bend as well of your carpet mm -hmm. so you're probably talking around 620 so i don't do mill 62 centimeters 62 centimeters and then you want to do length to length pull that to the edge of the black trim at the top you probably want to do 111 so 62, 62 and 111. And you got a knife, have you? Yeah, if you open the door. I did get some. You kind of want that bit. Like the bottom bit is going to be thicker than the top. So at the bottom bit, you probably want around 100 or 10. So yeah, do 100. 112 by 10. That's the, then you can stick the bottom one on first, yeah? can three sections around it. I'm just gonna see how how it looks. Um it's quite hard using really blunt scissors um done on the kitchen floor but to be honest I don't think anyone's gonna look that closely. So here goes. <laughs> I mean, some bits look okay, but the adhesive isn't very good. Look, you can see it's showing there. It's not very good at all. Like, I could easily just peel that off. So I'm thinking maybe I didn't put enough on. So I, I think I'll try and spray some more in around it. when you try and cut fabric with shit scissors. But we can just, um, we can fix something. Yeah, it def I mean, this bit doesn't look too bad, and yeah, it is definitely better than what it is, but it's that top bit that's really bad. Yeah, the cut's not great, is it? No, but they were very blunt scissors. We'll figure something else out. Moving on.
far forward they are. Yeah, because I weren't expecting them to go there. I was expecting them to go on the. What, on there. Yeah, on, no, on the on the metal. But yeah, oh. All well, they that, can't go on the metal, can they? I didn't know that. Because the clip with Scott. Why don't you move them back then? Yeah. Because we can't think about that, can we? Right. <laughs> Unless you want to wire them as well. Wire them to the back like that as well. But you're still going to have the issue of it falling on your face. Trial and error! Trial and error! I don't think they're quite long enough. What do you mean? To sleep. If they were longer, you could tuck them down the bed. They're not, I weren't planning on them being that long. You've got to remember, your heads go all the way to the back, babe. So. No, yours yeah. doesn't. You sleep like here. No, I Trust will, me, will sleep do. all the way at the back. You don't, Harry. Because <laughs> your pillows are there, so your head is on your pillow here. So we're usually about here when we're asleep. Okay. But if it's a problem, we can just get another wire and wire them down. That's fine. If you don't want them to hang. If, if it's not going to work with them hanging, just wire the bottom, the same as we've got to do on the kitchen side. Huh? So as you can see, where we've put them here, the curtains are way too far forward because these little screw things, holders, um, don't go in the metal. So, yeah, we've put them too far forward. So we're going to try and move them back. And if that doesn't work, then we're going to use curtain wire. To go underneath to then like pull them down, which we have to do on the kitchen side because on the kitchen side, we're going to be putting the curtains on the wood and that will fall forwards. And we don't want that anywhere near the hob, obviously. So that'll be wired down so that they're straight straight so they're not hanging over i mean I think that's and then you pull them along both ends get the wire then get the wire man what's this how's i put it i shall go and retrieve said item so have you got a good pair of cutters yeah okay so are they in here Right. So the trick is you have to do it slightly smaller than you need it. So it springs. So you really pull it. Okay, pass the cuts then. And then. Have you got another one of these? Yes, things? hang on. I like them a lot. Yeah. Just looks weird at the moment because the other side's not finished. But yeah, I it's think. It's a shame they can't go higher. Well, that's kind of, yeah, that's the problem. What would happen then if. Let's try again! <laughs> Let's put you back in the original. So we've got one curtain up. Yeah, we just need some more of them. But we need to get some more hooks from the wire because we originally <sighs> thought we were only going to need this once, but. We needed it more than that. Um, you're right. So we just need to get some more hooks for the wire. Um, we've obviously done the, well, I've done some of the carpeting and it's all right, isn't it? It's, average. it's not great, <laughs> especially not the top. It looks really bad, but again, it looks better than what it looks without it. So. Go on then, let's go. Well, I've hit your shoes. Well, I can see one and two. Really <laughs> see in a minute. Oh, we need some more that go in there, don't we? Yeah, that's what I mean. You need the whole lot. More of them. You need two that's of them and good. two of the hooks. Go on then. Okay. That 
was unsuccessful. Oh, his nan's not there. If you go, it shuts at four, you can go now, you can get him. Mm. We put the curtains up then. Oh, yeah, you can. Come on. Go on. I want you to. I'll ask you earlier. Okay, doesn't matter. Go and get him. Because otherwise, we can't do nothing the rest of the day and you'll feel bad for it. You know I might. <laughs> exactly. I kind of got the curtain hooks ish, um, and now I've got to go and get the most important thing for the weekend the beer. Boom goodies. Oh, what we got? I've got you, hang on, a J per Indian Pana 6%. Ooh. I want to get you drunk. I've got, I did get two of the same because I thought they looked really cool. And that's these ones. Oh. I, allow Sarara and Nevada. I thought they were quite, they looked quite yeah. cool. And. 5.6% again. Yep, and then this other Indian pale ale. Ooh. It was very nice. Give and then go, I, I got myself. Oh. oh, wow. And also, because I haven't had it in years, Milka. Ever had Milka? I have had Milka in Germany, I think I had Milka. It, it, I think it's German or it po Polish or something. And then what I actually went for. <laughs> yeah, we can cut some of the hooks down, can't we? Make hooks out of them. Perfect, let's rock and roll. Well, it would be rude not to, wouldn't it? You're so coming on our first trip away, Rubes. How lay down then? She liked it, don't you? Yeah. Are you happy you went and brought them now? Yep. Yeah. What did I tell you? You said if you don't go and get them, you'll we won't be able to do anything else today and you'll feel bad for it. Yeah. And now I feel really glad that I did go and get them. Oh, myself. Can I take your shoes off? No. These stubby holders we got from Rip Curl in 
Australia, obviously. We went to Australia last Christmas uh, and I got to meet all of Harry's family. He's got some family that live over there. And we were hopefully planning on going next year for a year, but with the whole lockdown thing, we probably can't. So that's why we thought we'll really throw ourselves into getting the van done and we can go and do Europe instead. Um, Cause that's like more, that's more possible really. Exactly. So. Episode four, point. That's it, there's no point. Is there nothing to do tomorrow? Well, I don't know, is there anything to do tomorrow? I'm sure we can find some other stuff to do tomorrow. If not, maybe a rest day. COVID, don't we? Huh? We've got nothing to do now, if we say. Yeah, maybe we could just chill. Yeah. Curtains look good though. <laughs> they do, don't the they? The wiring's been neatened. Another light's been put in. We painted that bit. Yep, the bit of the worktop's bit painted. Bit of the worktop's painted. We're thinking we might need to get a new rod for them curtains. Yeah, Harry broke it. Because Harry broke it. But um, they'll, they'll do for now. They show the point of them, don't they? Mm-hmm. No, I'm quite happy. I think we've had a good day. I think if anything, we're just, just finishing touches now, isn't it? Yeah, all them little carpeting bits, which didn't go too well. Yeah, so one more curtain to go that side. Carpeting. And then I think... A fridge. Yeah, that's probably the one bit. It's not really much to do, is it? It'd be wiring No, we in. just need to buy it. We might get for tonight. Them. Cheers. Beers and fajitas. See ya. I think it's time we had a clean. Harry's still in the bath, but I'm gonna make a start at giving this a proper clean up now that we've only got a few bits left to do. Let's get to it. have purchased. Sorry, I'm gonna make lunch in here in a minute. So we've both got some lovely bamboo plates and blam blamboo, bamboo bowls in my favourite colour, which is a nice light baby blue. I've got these really cute little kitchen utensils. They're all bamboo and I just love the little colours at the top. They're so cute. So we're going to be putting a utensil and spice rack in one on the side here. So just here. So the spice rack will go along here and then there'll be hooks on the spice rack which will then hook the utensils on. This is one of my favourite bits. A collapsible dish drainer. Now I have a thing about like washing up when I'm camping, like I get quite serious about it and I can't stand it when people just wash stuff and then leave it like in the bowl when it's, uh, no, no, it's got to go somewhere for it to, and then it just flattens. So thank you eBay for that one. Now I'm gonna make myself some lunch in here. <laughs> I'm gonna cook, let's go. Absolutely love it. Um, it's two for two quid in Morrison's at the moment, so thank me later for that one.
Well, that was delightful if I do say so myself. I'm gonna give this a tidy up now. I'll see you in a bit. that well um, there's a few sticky bits in here so what I have heard is good for vinyl flooring is apple cider vinegar so I'm gonna get some of that and give it a proper good scrub but apart from that that's this week's video done Sierra Nevada, no not Spain, where's Sierra Nevada? Where's Sierra? Nevada, where's Nevada? Oh America. Hold on. Shit, I said Spain. <laughs> where's Sierra Leone? Africa. <laughs> no, I'm not close. Yeah. Actually, Africa is close, can I try it? I'm gonna hate it, aren't I? Oh, it reminds me of Australia. Oh, it's like what I had in Little Creatures. Yeah, that's a pale out. Up you get them, out the way. 